Kiora. Mad Chef Radio. Dan Dangaro, as you might know me from the interwebs. I'm just here to do a quick review about the Shiba Heart Shaped Rice Cooker. Um, this is actually surprisingly a good thing. Uh, it went viral on Twitter about four or five months ago. This is being recorded in uh, the absolute beginning of February, end of January 2022. So the end of 2021, this went wild. I ordered one through Wish.com. Well, sorry, uh, AliExpress. Um, and it took a while to get here. Um, there's currently logistical dramas thanks to COVID-19. I know a lot of people on YouTube don't want to talk about this because they feel it'll age their videos. Don't care. Um, this is the thing we're all living through right now. So this cost me landed um, 128 Australian dollars, which is not the bargain basement position I thought it was going to be. Um, you can get rice cookers much cheaper. This is 1.8 litres of rice um, that can be cooked. Um, it is adorably hard shaped. Um, the internal, this is what it looks like inside, the actual cooker itself is in my dishwasher because I baked another cake in it to make sure the cakes worked. Um, so to go on about this bad boy, it is a programmable one. It has, I don't know if you can see that on the front, but it's got eight different functions. Now they are labeled soup, slow cooking, fast cooking, porridge, multigrain, yogurt, cake, and keep warm. Now, I have actually used this 14 days as my only thing to cook with. Just because if you're gonna buy this, with the price point that it's sitting at, um, you're probably in a no kitchen situation. Um, the inside of the machine, the insert, is a Teflon analogous material. It's the sparkly copper, copper wipe off stuff. So hit it with a soft cloth and filth just wipes off. It also doesn't get hot enough really to burn things. So if you are in a no kitchen situation, if you're in a dorm room or another situation like that, camper van boat, etc., where you are just cooking and this is the only equipment you've got, this is actually pretty good. Um, I baked a cake in this thing. I cooked spaghetti, spaghetti bolognese in it. I've made yogurt, uh, pre-purchased pre packet uh, yogurt machine yogurt. So I didn't actually start with a fresh culture. It's a powdered material, you follow the instructions, and this will actually cook it and do a reasonably good job of doing it. Now, I say reasonably good job because packet yogurt isn't that great of a product to start with. This makes it as well as you would expect it to do. Uh, the cake I baked in it was packet cake. This made the packet cake as well as you would expect it to. Um, it is not, you're not gonna get fantastic results from this. I cooked spaghetti bolognese in it. It was not the best spaghetti bolognese I've ever made, but it, it's a goddamn rice cooker. By no, in no way, shape or form should I be able to cook spaghetti bolognese in it. But put this thing on fast cook, throw in your mints, um, throw in your canned tomatoes, your pasta, does an okay job. Yeah, the pasta's a little overcooked. The meat's fully cooked. Like, it, if you've got nothing else, this will do it. This is a good machine. It, it is heavier, more heavily constructed than it has any right to be. Like, it doesn't feel cheap. Um, like, it, it feels well made. Um, the company that I bought this from, we're pretty good about everything. Um, I'm gonna put a link to the AliExpress um, thing that I bought from. They don't know I'm doing a review. They don't know I've got an affiliate link. Although I'm gonna throw um, customers their way potentially. Um, but I wanna talk about it, its shortcomings uh, because I kind of think we need to talk about them because this is not completely unabridged good. It is just a rice cooker. It, it does one thing really well, which is cook rice. Everything else it kind of does is a little bit extra. So while you can cook soup, cake, grains, porridge, um, spag bowl in it if you have to, don't expect miracles. Don't expect this to be the be all and all. It, in a pinch, will do everything you need it to. But it's not gonna do anything it's not going to blow the doors off. You are not going to amaze anybody with your cooking with this. Um, the adorable heart-shapedness and the pink of it, I think, make it even better. Um, 
because I think these things should be cute, should be adorable. At the end of the day, the rice cook's exactly the same in a heart-shaped rice cooker as it does in a perfectly round one. Um, the case you bake in this will be heart-shaped. I think that's kind of adorable. Um, what else can I really say? It works. It works far better than I thought it would. Um, it is better constructed than I thought it would be. It is a surprisingly good product. Um, and I would recommend if you are going into a situation where you have no kitchen, you can do worse than getting one of these things. Um, I don't have a modern slow cooker anymore. Um, I did have one that was 15 years old about five years ago. So I've had one from the early 2000s and they weren't bad for trying to do everything. Um, but the ease of cleaning on this bad boy, um, it works. Uh, the only downside, uh, sorry, the, one of the real negatives is, I'm not sure if this is going to come up on screen, but most of the, no it's not even going to, uh, most of the writing on this is actually Chinese first, um, English second. Uh, for those who care about the energy efficiency of a rice cooker, this is setting fairly in the middle. Uh, it's fairly standard, it basically uses a resistive element to heat up material. Um, not particularly efficient, but you're not cooking big amounts of stuff, so that's okay. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, it wasn't wasn't cheap. I'd like to thank my Patreons uh, for being able to provide me the spare money to be able to get toys like this to mess around with. Um, I was really hoping this would be trash so I could do a longer video about how terrible it is, but it isn't. It's good. Uh, and if you have the money for one like this, this is a good deal. If you want to buy someone a present and you get something like this, it's it's good. It's good. It, it by all rights, by all rights, this went viral. This should be a cheap piece of trash. And it's not. It's good. And it deserves to have gone viral. And it is a good product. Um... And yeah, like I said, for two weeks, I cooked every meal, every hot meal I had came out of this bad boy. So if you have to, you can. Um, yeah, Jesus, I wish, I wish there was more to say, but it works. Um, and it works as well as you would expect. Um, considering its price point, yeah, there's, there's nothing really negative to say because of where it sits. It, it really is, it's 120 bucks. That may seem, seem expensive to Americans, but that's kind of, if you're an American, that's sitting at like the $50 mark. Like, it's, it's a significant amount of money to throw out on a single toy, but when, it, it, when you can bake a cake in your rice cooker, because it's got a cake setting, that to me is kind of worth it, um, if for nothing else. Now, you, now you've got set and forget cakes. Um, yeah, so, wish there was more to say, but it, it, it works. It's fairly priced. Um, yeah. <laughs> Sorry to not be able to tear this little thing apart, but it is awesome.